Suplice community, the Bulgarian Bag Championships are now an official Suplice event. And we are excited to announce that this year there are already three Bulgarian Bag Championships planned internationally. And one of them taking place on September 23rd in Boise, Idaho as the very first championships in the United States. But before we get into all of that exciting information, we need to take a moment to thank and recognize those who made this all possible. The Bulgarian bag was invented by founder of Suplis, Ivan Ivanov, whom we wouldn't be where we are today if it weren't for him. So biggest of thank yous to Ivan. The Bulgarian bag championships were created and organized by the owner of the Suplis Training Center in Poland, Tomek Wachinski along with his amazing training center team. Finally, we would like to recognize the lead Suplice Pro instructor in Poland, Leon Kletschik. He played a huge role in sharing Suplice within Poland, growing the community and creating such an immense impact along with Ivan Tomek and his entire team. The strength of the international Suplice family and community is really like no other. No matter who you are or where you are from, if you enjoy training with the Suplice equipment, then you are welcome as a part of our community. And isn't it so amazing that this Suplice family, working together, lead to the opportunity for events that were once just dreams for us all, such as the Bulgarian Bag Championships. If you've been keeping up with us over the last couple of months, you will have seen that last year in 2022, we were in Poland for the grand opening of the Suplice Training Center. and the Bulgarian Bag Championships. At those last championships, we had four countries represented, and those were Poland, Hungary, Bulgaria, and the United States. In this video, we are going to cover the categories, discipline, rules, and expectations of the championships, along with what is Bulgarian Bag Elite. There are three different categories from which you can compete in, and those are Suplice Fit, Suplice Strong, and Suplis Extreme. Each category is separated by gender and the weight of Bulgarian bag. In the Suplis Fit category, women compete with the 11 pound, 5 kilo Bulgarian bag and men compete with the 17 pound, 8 kilo bag. In the Suplis Strong category, women compete with the 17 pound, 8 kilo bag and men compete with the 26 pound, 12 kilo bag. And finally, in the Suplis Extreme category, Women compete with the 26 pound, 12 kilo bag, and men compete with the 37 pound, 17 kilo bag. I am grateful for having the chance to have competed in the championships last year, and had the honor of being the first and only woman to compete in the extreme category, as well as setting the world record for the only person to qualify two of the five exercises inside of the Bulgarian bag elite standard which Suplice instructor Holly Lewis will go over along with the discipline, rules, and expectations of the championships. And be sure to stay tuned till the end of this video as I will be sharing some tips and advice on how to best prepare yourself for success at the championships. The Bulgarian Bag Championship consists of five disciplines. The Suplice Spin, the Swing Squat, the Suplice Snatch, the squat press, and the spin arm throw. When the time comes for you to compete, your name will be called from the warm-up area. You and your coach will be welcomed to the competition area where you will remain until all five disciplines have been completed. The competitor will take the platform as the coach remains in the coach's chair. You may bring a water bottle and sweat towel to your platform. A set of Bulgarian bags will be ready for you to choose your weight according to the category you registered for, fit, strong, or extreme. You are not allowed to step off or leave the platform until all five disciplines are complete. If you do, you will be disqualified. 
The coach must stay in the coaching area and not step onto the competition platform. Each competitor will have one judge assigned to them, verifying technique is correct in order for each rep to count. You will have a set amount of time to complete as many reps as possible for each discipline. You will be given one minute of rest between each discipline as well. The first discipline is a supless spin. You will hold the main handles of the Bulgarian bag with an outside grip. Each athlete will start with the body of the Bulgarian bag sitting parallel to the outside of one foot. When the timer goes off, you will spin the bag in front of your body, around your back, below your head, crossing in front and then past the opposite knee to complete one full rep. You may switch directions and rest as needed. Just to make sure you complete each full rep or else it will be a no rep and will not count. You must complete 210 of the suplice spins in six minutes to qualify this discipline for elite. When the six minutes is up, you will have one minute of rest before you begin the second discipline. The second discipline is a suplice swing squat. You will hold the main handles of the Bulgarian bag with an inside grip. The body of the Bulgarian bag will start behind the back of the legs in a hip hinge position. As you pull the Bulgarian bag between your legs, you must fully extend one of your arms as you squat. You must then return the Bulgarian bag back behind your legs to complete the full rep. You must complete 110 of the suplice swing squat in five minutes to qualify this discipline for elite. When the five minutes is up for this round, you will have one minute of rest before you begin the third discipline. The third discipline is the suplice snatch. You will hold the main handles with an inside grip. The body of the Bulgarian bag will start between your legs behind your heels. As you snatch the Bulgarian bag through your legs, your arms must come to a full lockout position overhead. You must return the Bulgarian bag past the back of your legs to complete the full rep. You must complete 80 of the suplice snatch in four minutes to qualify this discipline for elite. When the four minutes is up, you will have one minute of rest before you begin the fourth discipline. The fourth discipline is a suplice squat press. You will hold the two outer side handles of the Bulgarian bag with palms facing you at eye level. You will start in a 90 degree squat. On the timer, you will simultaneously come up out of the squat as you press the Bulgarian bag to a full extension overhead. Then return to the 90 degree squat to complete the full rep. You must complete 70 of the suplice squat press in three minutes to qualify this discipline for elite. When the three minutes is up, you will have one minute of rest before you will begin the fifth and final discipline. The fifth discipline is the suplice spin arm throw. You will hold the main handles of the Bulgarian bag with an outside grip. You will begin in the loaded arm throw position. When the round starts, you will shrug the Bulgarian bag off your shoulder immediately into a full suplice spin and then onto the opposite shoulder blade into the arm throw, making sure the Bulgarian bag is spun below your head and touches your back each time. You must complete 30 of the suplice spin arm throw in two minutes to qualify this discipline for elite. If you qualify all five disciplines, then you are indeed Bulgarian Bag Elite and will be presented a special award at the awards ceremony that evening. The elite athletes with the most reps in each category will also be awarded the first, second, and third place prizes. We will also be offering a Suplice gift card to the team with the most entries. Here are some tips and advice that I think will be helpful to you coming from a competitor from the Bulgarian Bag Championships. My first piece of advice is to be sure you train and practice for this event. I have been training with this equipment for over 10 years now and I even grew up with it, but I still made it a priority to train for this event. I recommend starting training about a month to a month and a half prior to the event and to attempt to complete the discipline at least once each week. I started training with the 11 pound bag and worked my way up to the 26 pound bag. Some exercises I even completed with the 30 pound bag just to give myself even more of a challenge. Along with that, be sure to practice each of these exercises so that you are sure that you can execute them nice and clean 
to make sure each rep counts for you in competition. My second piece of advice is to make sure you have a good nutritional regimen and that you are hydrated prior to and going into the championships. You want to make sure your body feels good and is ready to go into battle with the Bulgarian bat. My last piece of advice is be ready to have some fun. Don't go into this nervous, stressed or worried because I can confirm from having a past athletic career that nothing good comes out of going into competition nervous. Not only does it take away from your experience, but it takes away from your performance as well. When I was out at the championships, I walked in happy, smiling, no nerves. Even though I am Supless Fit Lady, I should be expected to perform well. I didn't let it get to me. I went out there, had some fun, smiled, shook it off, took a deep breath, grabbed a hold of my bag, and went to work. And I want you to do the same. Prove to yourself that you are Supless Strong. To, to register, register click, click the, the link, link in the, the description. description.